Removing oil from water is a crucial step in many processes across numerous industries. From extending tool life to staying in compliance with government agencies, oil skimmers provide a cost-effective solution to removing oil from water or coolant. Despite the various designs that oil skimmers have, all of them rely on the same basic principles, specific gravity, surface tension, and affinity. Most hydrocarbons have a lower specific gravity than water. Without agitation, oil separates from the water and floats to the surface. These oils are known as LNAPLs, light non-aqueous phase liquid. Oils and other compounds that sink in water have a higher specific gravity and are known as DNAPLs, dense non-aqueous phase liquid. Normally, oil bonds more tightly to itself and other materials than to water. This affinity and differences in surface tension between oil and water cause oils to adhere to a skimming medium. Belt-type oil skimmers use an endless belt of corrosion-resistant steel or synthetic medium, which is lowered into the tank or vessel to be skimmed. The belt passes through resilient wiper blades where the oil is removed from both sides of the medium. There are large tube skimmers and small tube skimmers, depending on the application. Tube oil skimmers use a floating plastic hose that snakes out over the surface of the liquid and is then drawn back through the drive unit where oil is removed. This design requires a relatively large amount of surface area for proper operation. This oil skimmer can skim from very shallow tanks. As a rule, the removal capacity is lower than belt, drum, or mop-type oil skimmers. Mini tube skimmers are very similar to the large tube units, but use either 5 16 or 3 8 diameter instead of 3 quarter inch. The pickup rate varies from 1 quart per hour to 0.5 gallons per hour, depending on the diameter of the tube. These units are fairly compact and can fit in tight spots. The better units will have the motor mounted underneath to bring room required over the lip of the tank down to near zero. The 3 8 inch diameter tube is preferable as it has a 1 gallon per hour removal capacity and enough stiffness to not drag on the housing and prematurely wipe off oil when being drawn into the unit. Disc oil skimmers rotate a disc-shaped medium through the liquid. Oil is wiped off and discharged into a collection container in a manner similar to belt oil skimmers. It is important to consider reach, the portion of the disc that actually gets immersed when looking at a disc oil skimmer. Less disc in the fluid means less oil removed. Obviously, fluctuating fluids can be a real problem for disc oil skimmers. There are several things to consider when choosing a skimmer type, belt, or tube material for your oil skimmer. Some plastics will not stand up to heat or strong chemicals. Certain metal belts will not skim coolants effectively. Smooth belts do not pick up floating emulsified oils. Specific plastic belts do not last in heated applications, while other types of plastic belts will. This is yet another reason why it is so important to pick a reputable oil skimmer vendor and tell them all the information about your application. They should have the knowledge and understanding that no two applications are alike, and not all belts and skimmers are the same. Choosing a skimmer based on size speculation can be a costly mistake. Buying the smallest skimmer available because it is the cheapest, or purchasing the biggest skimmer because you think it will work faster, will not lead to successful skimming results. Oil skimmers should be selected by the size of the area that needs to be skimmed, not just by the amount of oil needing to be removed. Choosing an oil skimmer that has the capacity to remove at least two times the capacity needed by the application should be the deciding factor. Oil skimmer capacities are based on optimum conditions and homogeneity of oil. Viscosity, temperature of the water, and other factors can affect the amount of oil picked up by an oil skimmer. It is impossible to accurately predict how fast your oil will be picked up. Therefore, as a rule of thumb, 
Purchase an oil skimmer that is rated at least twice the capacity needed. Planning is important. Before spending money on a concrete pad and mounting arrangements, check where the oil actually collects in your process. Oil skimmers should be located opposite from the inflow, and the tail pulley should be submerged two inches below the surface of the liquid in order to be as effective as possible. Using a tank that does not allow enough time for the oil to rise and float will not permit successful oil skimming. Always make sure your tank gives enough residence time for the oil to float. Oil skimming usually beats ultrafiltration systems in many applications. More often than not, installing large, complicated systems to remedy oil problems will not provide ideal results. You can save costs by using a relatively inexpensive oil skimming system to handle the free floating oil and then a smaller treatment system to handle the oil that has remained suspended. The bottom line? Oil skimmers cost less. Oil skimmers are effective for oil removal. Oil skimmers are environmentally sound, so keep it simple. We want to know all about your application. Oil skimmer selection can be a very complex process. There are numerous factors that go into selecting the right oil skimmer for your particular application. If the oil skimmer vendor does not know what chemicals or heat you have in your application, the wrong oil skimmer and belt materials could be selected and the job will not get done correctly. It is important that you gather as much information about your application as possible when you're ready to consult a vendor. Describing every component of your process and all the contents of the tanks is crucial. Be ready with the following information regarding your application. Temperature of the water. pH level. Area size being skimmed. Type of oil being skimmed. Water level. Any turbulence. Electric requirements. These are all conversation points that your vendor should inquire about and you should have answers to. Remember, in order to make the most out of your oil skimmer, the right skimmer and belt material needs to be selected to work perfectly with your application. An oil skimmer will only remove oil if it is properly maintained. There are basic maintenance tasks that should be done regularly to keep your oil skimmer operating correctly. Are the wipers contacting the belt smoothly? Is the belt riding away from the sides of the pulley? Are the troughs and wipers clear of debris? It is imperative that proper care and maintenance is maintained if you want your skimmer to provide the best oil removal performance possible. So show your skimmer some love. Don't let your skimmer look like this. It's not a good look. Buying from small, unheard-of oil skimmer manufacturers will probably result in no customer support when maintenance issues pop up and little to no knowledge of how to resolve those issues. Furthermore, parts will need to be replaced over time. Units might have to be changed or upgraded, or different belt materials need to be used. Disreputable vendors typically do not have a selection of materials or parts to choose from. Additionally, it is common for the smaller, unknown companies to go out of business after a few years, and you'll end up having to replace your skimmer with a different brand when all you needed were new parts. Paying a cheap price up front might result in you paying more in the long run. It's best to invest in a quality skimmer that is from a reputable vendor from the start. Oil skimmers are simple in design, but you'll still be better off with a skimmer that is manufactured with the highest quality. It will operate efficiently and consistently for a longer period of time. Removing oil from water is a necessary practice in many industrial applications. Spend your money wisely to get the job done right. Selecting an oil skimmer can be a complex decision-making process. There are various factors you have to consider about your application when choosing the right skimmer. However, Abenaki oil skimmers are durable and built to last, even in harsh applications. They have been proven in thousands of applications and are an environmental solution to unwanted oil and water. Abenaki sales reps have a vast knowledge on a wide variety of industrial applications. They're always available for phone calls, emails, or on-site consultations to help you find the right skimmer for your application. 
Need help? Call us. 